What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Dynasty Warriors 4 Expert Mode. We have an itch. Let's see. Play is Liu Bay on this one. He's kind of the one that makes the most sense, which we'll see why. We'll do the boys. No homo. Um, Our forces are small. We must join Jiang Fei at the old castle. They are strong. Do not fall. Battle of Runan actually is one of my absolute favorite Kessin 2 missions. I believe it's... Uh, it might be mission number two. But, uh, of course, in your first playthrough, the first battle's a tutorial anyway. So, I guess... Uh, depending on... And it's, it's a tutorial. I mean, it's from start to finish. It's... Uh, might actually be impossible to lose. Uh, We get a cutscene here. I think we may do. Hold on. Zhao Yu, my lord. I, Zhao Yu, shall now serve as your spear. The uh, the yellow turban guys uh, aren't here. Of course, uh, the story is that Li Bei is actually sent by Yuan Shao, although that doesn't really get mentioned too much. But he was sent to join with some rebels that were in the Runan area. Uh, to try to attack Cao Cao from the rear during the whole Guandu thing. Um, after the Yell Turban Rebellion was squashed, um, there were still a lot, a lot of those that were left, um, knowing that they had rebelled against the government, whatever, and already had a taste for violence. They turn to banditry. Uh, and of course, some of the people that were in the old turban movement were bandits to start out with that just kind of took advantage of the situation. But, uh... All that being said... There were a couple of them that were willing to join up with Lee Bay and attack Tao Tao. I guess, uh, of course, I think the way it's framed in the book is that they they see Lee Bay's virtue or whatever and want to join him. Uh, probably they saw a chance to uh, pack the capital get some riches out of it, but, um, very, 
my target is. I, Guan Yu, have returned. You cannot hope. I forget what hex marks gives you. Uh, might be luck. Faction leaders were all some of my favorite characters when I was a kid. Except Cao Cao, I didn't like him. I tried playing as him a few times and like, ah, this moveset doesn't really speak to me. Of course, later on I came to love it, but didn't like it at the time. On my shoulder. Is Gachi Moochie dead now? Is that phase over? Does anybody still make new Gachi Moochie? If you don't know what uh, Gachi Moochie is, um, it's G A C H I M U C H I. And, uh, It's kind of hard to describe. Um, I guess I, I would suggest to watch a video called Comfortably Spanked, if it's still on YouTube. It's, uh, it is a play on the Pink Floyd song and album. Or no, Comfortably Numb wasn't an album, excuse me. I know it's Dark Side of the Moon, like literally one of the most popular albums of all time, but... Uh, I mean, it has, the, it has, it's the same thing, it's tie-in. Give that a listen, and in time, you too will come to understand the power of Gachi Muji. It was super popular in the Hearthstone community for a very long time. I ain't gonna say it. Cow Cow ain't got the nuts to beat. Lightning is probably not the best element for you, but... Stretch. 
feasted. All right, thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, I hope you join me next time. Until then, bye-bye for now.